Welcome to the Jake Games Stream. Yo, what's happening guys? Welcome back to another episode of Dragon Age The Veil Guard. If you missed the last one, there will be a playlist that you can check out and catch up on the ones that you have not yet seen. Let's go ahead, jump right back in. I don't quite remember where it was that we left off, but we're gonna we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna find out. Okay, we'll need a boat to get there. Let's head to the dock. Hmm. Agreed. Okay. But first we need to get a handle on what exactly is happening out there. It changes by the hour. Okay. By the minute. Sounds good. So can we look at a bigger oh we can look at a bigger view of the map. Shadows crossing. Uh find the missing veil jumpers. So I think it's coming back to me now. We have um Oh a journal. Like we hit J. Uh, the story so far. Shadows Crossing. This is what we're looking for. Must investigate when the Veil Jumpers report that the town of Demetrius Crossing has gone silent. Find the missing Veil Jumpers. So we're still working on that. We had to like clear up some um, some Veil kind of covering thing that was going on here. And now we gotta head this way. Sounds good. Can we just like stop and talk to people? Or is that not a thing? I think that's not a thing. I think we can't we can't just talk to random people. That's fine. That's fine, just fine. Seems like a lot's happened around here. What hasn't happened? Yeah, dude. This stuff's... area is where Tevinter Magisters Oh, I can send her over there. Destroyed okay. Arlethan City centuries ago. Whole lot of blood magic during the war. What about now? Whatever Solus did stirred up everything again. The old blood magic from the war, it never went away. Oh. Ancient relics appear out of thin air, ruins float. Whoa. It's like an old wound that never healed. And now it's bleeding again. I don't want to interrupt their conversation. <laughs> I got to send, uh, I got to send you, Valeria, over there. Or Valera. Okay, so we just do that and that. I'm on She's it. going. She's going for it. How did you do that from over there? What the fudge? Can we get into here? I kind of want to get in here. There's like a, there's like a chest in there, right? Okay, we're picking this up. Oh, and that lets me in there. I got it. Uh, skein of yarn. 22 gold. Oh, I, I just realized that my face covers what I pick up, so you guys can't really, uh, y'all can't really see it, but that's okay. The face has to go somewhere, right? What is my face? That was the capital city, Arlethan. This Where? is what's left of it after the war. I don't imagine it floated back in the day. That was Arlethan? Why do they call it Arlethan? It used to be called Arlathan, wasn't it? I remember in the first game they always said Arlathan. Now they're all going Arlathan. Imperial weave. Uh, smooth pebble, flawless crystal. Okay, nice, nice. Not too shabby. Are we going into like another veil area where we're gonna have to clear up the uh, the foggy stuff? Or oh, these are like they almost seem like they should be shields or something. What's going on here? These look like people. Those are people. Those are tree people. What the heck is going on? What is this? Flawless crystal. Should I be going this way? I guess if I want to find all the secrets and stuff, right? Lament for Fallen Elvenen. Ooh, we put a ladder down. Is uh, We were looking for a boat or something, weren't we? Was this the way we were supposed to go? I think there's another... Yeah, there's another way we're supposed to go, but there's this. I feel like I need to investigate this, right? <laughs> Always important to investigate everything. Can we just take this boat? Can we just have this? Collect some heartwood. Uh, 
Randy Dowager, Quarterly, Volume 3. There's so much reading, like, um, in all the Dragon Ages. I never do all the reading, like I probably should. Oh, is this like a Dalish camp? see was this like back where I started yeah this is like back where I started isn't it okay I don't like this. so I just uh, unlocked like a shortcut basically nice and now we can just kind of go from there right up to here and then I think we got to go back this way Follow, let's actually follow the uh, the marker here. Let's do the, the good thing. It's getting spooky with all these like dead tree people things. It's like stuff is moving or something. Like the trees are moving. I feel like Lord of the Rings when, you know, the, uh, the Ents are doing their thing. What is this? What do we have here? What is it? What are this? Can somebody do something with this? Nobody can do things with this? Oh, she can heal me? That's kind of dope. I need to remember to use like their stuff more. Saving potion. Or no, is that going to heal her? I don't know. They, I mean, they should do their own actions, right? Currently inaccessible. Oh, that's butts. Let me access it. Maybe when we go do this, it'll allow access. Yeah, this still feels a bit Inquisition-like. I mean, other than the fighting, Rook, anything else ready to go. I guess so, yeah. What else are we doing? Yo. Nev, you sure you're up for this? I'm fine. Couldn't sit so much longer. She then let's go. Beat the frig up. Hopefully she's doing all right. We're heading out. Let's freaking do it. I've never seen fog this thick in Demetta's Crossing. It's fade fog. Oh, you know what? Can I pause? Oh, okay, never mind. I want to turn their voice volume up a little. This isn't right. The dock usually has people bringing goods to market, bartering and shouting. It's always busy. Something happened here. Stay sharp. Hmm. What is happening? Something bad's going down here. I guess we're going to have to solve it. Uh, yeah, I meant to do it. I was changing some of the settings before I started today. I meant to kind of bump up maybe speech volumes all the way up. Maybe we just turn global volume up a little bit. Maybe that'll be better. Menu volume. We don't need that to be high, do we? Ambient, uh, we probably turn that down some too. That ought to be good, right? Mute when minimized. No, let's not do that. All right, that should be that should be hopefully a little bit better. It's so quiet. Too Sloth quiet. Sloth man, he says Where solve it. Solve it. What am I supposed to solve? The uh, the volume? Am I solving that? Or have I already solved it? That is the real question. Break all your freaking crap here. Get this crap out of here. Nobody likes it. Yeah, you like storing stuff here? Not anymore, you don't. 
What is this? You want to have a cart here? No. No thanks, pal. Softman says, I don't know. I just wanted to say solve it. Oh, I'm solving it, dude. How you doing today, Slothman? This is how we solve it. Get out of here. Get your crap out of here. This stuff is not going on boats. Not today. Get out of here. Frig off. Uh, Sloth says, good you? Oh, I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. Just, you know, breaking all their stuff. Feels, feels like a good day. idea. People should be out selling eggs and buying bread. But everything's just abandoned. Yeah, it looks they like people barricaded like... the main entrance into town. There's blight in there. I can feel it. Be careful. Blight. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm a uh, Grey Warden. So there's like Darkspawn here, huh? Are we... Are we in a blight? Like, is this is this the beginning of a blight? Or is a blight confirmed to already be... Oh, yeah, it looks bad in there. <laughs> I think we can get in over here. Over here? What are we gonna... Are we gonna break this down, or... I don't know that we can break this. Maybe we... Oh, we can hop over. I got it. Oh, yeah, dude. This looks real bad. Looks real bad. It's blight. Even worse than in the forest. You do they right, need buddy. to stay in. Oh. You okay? What happened here? Keep them inside. Listen to the mayor. Hello? I don't think he can hear us. I think he's blighted. He's got the blight. I wonder why, uh... Right now... Prism is showing me zero viewers on YouTube, but we got the sloth man. I don't know why it's funky sometimes. Like that. Prism, you're doing you're doing a bad. Oh, there we go. That did nothing. That's fine. It is what it is. Yeah, that guy's definitely got like uh he's got the corruption, we'll he's got the blight. All of us. No, you can't leave. Hey, can you hear me? Just stay here, and everything will be fine. Hmm. They got a bad mayor, huh? The mayor was just like, hey, just stay in here. We're going to lock ourselves in with the blight. Someone used powerful magic to dominate fine. the minds of these villagers. So, uh, Slothman, did you end up building the uh, the arena? Is, is it done? Has the, the been done? Square. We need to search for survivors. Let's see what we can find. Fan out. Well, let's go ahead and get uh, this. Come on. Give me, give me that. Blighted. You don't want to stand in the blight. It makes you blighted. Well, see, as a Grey Warden, I already have the blight. Oh, you need Deep Slate. I see. So you're going to have to go on a, a mining adventure, huh? This guy not alive. Anybody around here still alive? Is there a mayor here who's um, doing bad stuff? Look at that. Is that an Aravel on the roof? The blights must have lifted it up there. Oh. Oh, it is an Aravel. Deep Slate's annoying because it this takes so long to mine. I knew her. She was a farmer. Sold spices to us. The best in Arlathan. Hmm. I can't believe this happened. Yeah, that's a shame. It's all a shame that this happened. How the frig, man, did that push that up to there? That's crazy. Can we go in any of these houses? No entrance. No entrance. Oh, yeah, dude. It's like packed full of Blight and bodies. Oh, that's gross. That's freaked this up. This blight is weird. Yeah, it is. Uh, Sloth made a spectating area. Nice. Very nice. That's pretty cool. Some, some like, seeding. Let's see. 
Ever seen anything like it? Never. Blight's usually dead, static, but this is alive. Some special kind of. Blight, okay, let's huh? keep going. Might be more survivors. The survivors are blighted, though. Like those other guys we talked to, they were all messed up. What was that? Something big. Stay sharp. Darkspawn? Over there. And over? Two more survivors. Hey, what's going on here? Find the Veil Jumpers. Bring them to the mayor. They're talking about Jahel and Milva. They said bring them to the mayor. If we find the mayor, then maybe we'll find your friends. Hmm. Sloth said, gonna make more seats on the outside in case you want to be on the outside instead of inside. Okay, that sounds good. That's cool. It's a cool idea. Must keep looking. Must find the veil jumpers. They're the mayor said to find them. They're in the village. Only a matter of time. Huh. Okay, things are getting weird, man. I hear that Why spooky brawl out there, jumpers? too. What did the mayor want with them? Yeah, I don't know. What could the mayor have wanted with veil jumpers? I could have been a veil jumper, you know? Uh, but instead I chose the Grey Wardens. Look, oh, there's more, more people. people. With Must their round up everyone. Must get them inside. We will be rewarded. They're rewarded for bringing everybody in here? Dude, this is freaky. Destroy it when it's vulnerable, pulsating state. Oh, God, this is gross. This is disgusting. Hmm. Milva! That's one of your fellow Veil Jumpers? Valara! They're turning it into some bladed Jahel. creature. He's alive. Belara. We're we're going to help you. We'll get you down, Jahel. No. Listen. The gods. The gods have returned. I saw them. I heard their voices. The gods did this? Dude. A blood ritual. To release the blight in the villagers they said they needed power Belara, be careful holy crap we're gonna see some wild blighted creatures I feel like the gods caused this why would they do this Oh, this is freaky, man. I wasn't expecting it to be this spooky. Come on, that sounds close. All right, we'll go help. I am scared. Help me, hurry! Archdemon? Here. No, 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 please. Hey. It's an archdemon, isn't it? Fresh blood, a hungry heart, creature. Come to me. What is happening? I 
I know you. You're the mayor of this town. The village. The people. Are they, uh... Blighted. Dead. All of them. You gave them to the gods, didn't you? Oh. Didn't you? They were in my head. Infecting my thoughts. They made me do it. Please, help me. Uh, Slothman said, logging back on the SMP to get more dirt for spawn. We don't want dirt at spawn. We want the natural stone. You're ruining nature. Um, I'm going to tell him to tell us everything because we need more information. You're not going anywhere until I get the full story. I tried to protect people. You have to believe me. The gods told me to lure the Veil Jumpers to the center of town. The others were to be rounded up and kept safe. They would be the first to witness the glory of Gilanane's new creation. She showed me gold. So much gold. Hmm. You lured the Veil Jumpers? So you brought the Veil Jumpers to the middle of town. For a blood sacrifice. <clears throat> Because the gods needed power. Did you know what the gods would do? The Veil Jumpers, they were just strangers. I thought if they were taken first, everyone else might be spared. So you did know? The gods exploited his greed and fear. I'm supposed to feel sorry for him? I say we leave him right here. But I'll die. The blight everywhere. What if the dragon comes back? If we let you go, you'll run straight back to the gods. They were in his head. Their influence might linger. I understand what they do now. I won't be tempted again, I swear. Rook, you're a Grey Warden. You could pack him off to Weishaupt as punishment. Uh, yo, Turbo in the chat. What up, Turbo? How you doing today, buddy? Welcome, welcome. Things are getting wild. There's all kinds of fudged up creatures and weird things going on. I say if we got Blight stuff going on, we're going to need more Grey Wardens. I say we send him to the Grey Wardens. Let's we'll go. send him to the Wardens. No! I I I'll never survive that. We take anyone, even murderous traitors like you. It's more than you deserve. You don't understand. I felt their power. It's irresistible. You're going to spend the rest of your life fighting Darkspawn. That's not enough to redeem you, but it's a start. But be grateful I'm even giving you this chance. Yeah. I'm doing good, Turbo. How you doing? The fade had opened, and the gods were free. Thanks to Solus, they'd woken up to find their empire, their subjects, even their fellow gods, all gone. Turbo but they good? still had the power of the very blight. Nice, very nice. And corrupting a village was just the start. Things are getting wild here, man. They made plans to tap more of the blight. All of it. To rebuild their empire. As a path to power, it had its costs. And everyone would pay for it. Hmm. We're getting some, like, the gods are trying to get back to their previous empire that they ruled over. And so, like, they're sacrificing people through blood magic to, like, gain power. This is getting wild. Uh, during the game, you will open up fast travel beacons, which are also save checkpoints, explore local maps, discover beacons locations. So, is that, like, one of them? Because that kind of looks like that would be what that is. And that hand over there, but maybe not. There's um, these creatures and stuff they're they're messing with. It's like Turbo's cousins or something. There was that uh that well it was the puppy. We fought a puppy already, a big old angry puppy. There's like tree folks. They seem dead though. I don't know what happened with that. Um, we're going back to uh, what's this game called? The Dragon Age No More Inquisition. Yes, this is Dragon Age Four No More Inquisition. That's actually true. The uh, the Inquisition's gone. 
Well, I don't know. I don't remember. I think we kept it as like a peacekeeping group or something. There was uh, decisions that you made, you know, in uh, Inquisition at the end to decide if you're going to disband or like keep it as a peacekeeping or if you're just going to keep the Inquisition in general. Just keep it how it is. Uh, we got to talk to these folks. Did you find our scouts? They're dead. I'm sorry. Elgrenon and Gilanane sacrificed them in some kind of ritual. Creators. What about the rest of the village? The ritual spread blight everywhere. The entire village was overrun. The few who survived are controlled by blood magic. Their minds are gone. Elgrenon and Gilanane used them like puppets. Hmm. Whoa. I dare say it was a show of force. Oh. She's back. They will not rest until you are on your knees, fearful, cowering, helpless in the face of such power. Lady Morrigan? Tis simply Morrigan to you, Scout Harding. She what a pleasure speaking. to see you again. Rook, this is Morrigan, an old acquaintance. I thought she could help. Morrigan helped the Inquisition when Varric and I were part of it. She knew more about ancient magic than anyone except Solus. Twas both pleasure and necessity to help then, as it is now. Stopping Elganon and Gilanane shall require many hands. Uh, Sloth said Arena is almost done. Then Sloth said, Jake fell in love. Whoa. <laughs> Say what? Uh, I think it's time for you to sleep, Sloth. Go sleep. Yeah, it's, it's past your bedtime, buddy. Uh, I still want to talk about the not again part in Origins SMP. Nah, you, you're good. You don't need, don't need to. Um, I'm glad for her help. Then I we look need forward more to your again. help. How refreshing. Your cooperative nature is appreciated in return. What can you tell us about all this... As dangerous as Solus himself may be, his imprisonment of the gods was just. To leave them unchecked would have been the very end of Thedas. Sloth says, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Let's talk about it. No. All this for power. More? So you know the Dreadwolf. Just to be clear, you know your old friend Solus is actually the Dreadwolf. So I have come to learn. It rather explains how he knew such a great deal of ancient elven history, and why he became so vexed when I attempted to explain it to him. Whilst I cannot claim the same depth of knowledge, the knowledge I do possess is yours for the asking. I hope it helps. For all we know, the entire world will look like Demetis Crossing once the gods are through. Um, Sla said, it's 8 a.m., no it isn't. Yeah, you need to sleep more, Tur uh, Sloth Man. Turbo's right. I did this morning. Before uh, This morning, I set my alarm for 7.30. It went off, and I woke up, and I was, like, about to get up. And I was like, you know what? I'll set it back for 8, and I'll go back to sleep for a half hour. I thought I set it, but I didn't actually set it. So by the time I woke up, it was, like, 8.45. <laughs> so, so I jumped up and ate breakfast real quick and came and started streaming. It's like, uh, I, I was kind of running late today. Um, all this for power. All this horror because a bunch of power-hungry gods want even more power. When have the powerful among us ever done otherwise? True. So how do we stop them? Set aside your notions of godhood and see them for the ancient powerful mages they are. Standing against them shall require serious magic of your own. When you interrupted the Dreadwolf's ritual, did you happen across any of the tools he used? He had a dagger, but it got lost in the chaos. Then you would do well to find it. Ooh, Tis better back. in your hands than those of the gods. Is there anything else Solus might have had that could help us? We're in his, well, he calls it the lighthouse. Ah, yes. The legendary sanctum of the Dreadwolf. 
It is said his Illuvian, the Viravas, could travel to any other Illuvian of his choosing. That's not how it works mm. right now. It only goes to Arlithin. I can take a look at it. Maybe fix it, even. I know Illuvians better than most. Any help you can offer, we'd appreciate. If Illuvians even work the same way, all the magic is different now. Our gods are back. Our gods. And they're mm -hmm. killing people and yeah, blinding the world. How do we stand up against that? Yeah, how do you stand up against uh, gods that came back? Well, like uh, Morgan said, we got to see them as not gods, but as uh, the powerful mages. Uh, Turbo said, what did you have for breakfast? So I had an egg and a sausage patty. Uh, and cheese on a low carb tortilla. It's not too shabby. It's pretty tasty. It's good stuff. Um, we work together, you know? None of us can do this alone, but we can stop them together. Ballara, you're one of the only people in the world who can get our Alluvian working. Harding can track down the Lyrium Dagger, and Nev can spot any clues we might miss that give us more information. Let's get to work. There's a lot of fight ahead of us. Indeed. Prepare yourselves well and have a care in your choices. These are the times in which legends are born or slain. Ooh. In this battle, I shall render whatever assistance I am able. Right. Let's move. Let's go for it. Uh, Sobman says, I don't need sleep. I was sleeping for 15 hours. Good God, 15 hours. That is a long sleep. By gods, you mean my grand, 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 grandparents, right? Yeah, you know how they were locked up in the uh, in the Fade by um, Solus, the Dreadwolf, that egghead that we had as a friend in the last game? Well, he, he let him loose. I guess it was kind of our fault. We interrupted his ritual, and so they got out. I think he had a plan, but... After investigating the town of Demetis Crossing, the team discovered the gods had laid waste to the town with blight. Worse, they tempered tempted the mayor into betraying his people for gold. The team decided to banish the mayor to the Grey Wardens. I think that's a good idea. I think if we have Blight stuff going on, we're going to need more Grey Wardens. It, what use would it be to kill him when we could actually use him, you know? Let him pay for his crimes by doing work. How do we go back to the lighthouse? That's, like, supposed to be our main base, I suppose, but, like, how do we get back You here? can do this, Lace. It's gotta be done. Why are we... What are we doing? Why do I feel like this game is only happening because of you? Uh, <laughs> it is. <laughs> <clears throat> I caused all of this. It was all me. Single-handedly. Fudged up the entire world. I should have taken the shot. That would have made things worse. You don't know that. All you have are guesses. Yeah, and yours is a guess too. We're up against something working with more rumors than facts. Of course that's all I have. I should have taken the shot. See, she you can't know what would have happened if she had taken the shot or if she hadn't taken the shot. So either way, both sides are guesses. So there's no point in her being all worried about it. Uh, we need to support each other. We shouldn't be at each other's throats. I'm not. Nev, I'm not. I don't blame you. Or Rook. Or anyone. Good. So just yourself. How's that working out? Tried to stop the world from being swallowed by chaos, and now it might be swallowed by chaos anyway. Exactly. Elven gods escape from their prison. Solace is in your head. And we're scrambling to figure out what to do. And Varric? Varric knew the risks. He knew what it might cost. We're still standing. The fight's not over. You know, I like that about you, Lace. You don't stop fighting. You push for answers and action. While I can get stuck on questions forever. Well, we need someone who can put the pieces of the puzzle together. We're fighting the unknown. Exactly. Everyone has a part to play. Varric brought us together because of our strengths. He wanted a team he could rely on. We have to be that team. Play to our strengths. And rely on each other. I think I can manage that. Then let's find Solace's dagger. It'll be a start. 
Turbo says, if you would have just let him finish, it would be okay. See, that's what he's claiming. He says he had a plan to not release the gods, but he's... <coughs> um, he's trying to completely rip down the veil between our world and the world of spirits. And the gods were trapped in the Fade, which is the world of spirits, so how would him tearing the veil down not have released them? And we tried to stop him because he was going to kill... He didn't care that he was about to kill a bunch of people by doing what he was doing. He said, people die uh, all the time. When we told him, like, hey, you're going to... You know, people are going to die when you do this. He's like, yeah, people Look, die all the time. Big there's deal. There's magic lingering in the spot. Strong. Old. The dagger was here. Something took it. Hmm. What if the gods already have it? Uh, Turbo says, honestly, Sola seems like a chill guy. I, I mean, he wasn't too bad in Inquisition. I, you know, he seemed like Dark a good spawn. guy. Oh, no. What if it took the dagger? Only one way to Ooh. find out. Yeah, that's not good if the Darkspawn have it. How do we get up there? Can we, uh... Ah, we break through. Look, yeah, there I mean, it goes. <clears throat> let's collect some heartwood. Yeah, I mean, Solus wasn't a bad guy, really, in the last one. He did. Actually, he's one of the good gods. Like, the gods, the old elven gods, were just mages. We, we know that now. Powerful mages. And he was actually one of the good ones, because he saw that, like, the other gods were kind of getting power hungry, and they didn't care about the people. Big dark spawn <clears throat> coming right at oh. us. Now we fight. Yeah, he, he, you know, he saw that the other gods didn't care about, um, you know, helping people or anything like that. Dude, that was a wild freaking We have freaking to go after maneuver. that ghoul. Let's get this gate open. Look up there, that magical device. Oh. So. Um, did I shoot it? Huh. Anyways, what was I saying? Solus locked away the gods because they didn't care about people. They cared about power. They're power hungry, frigged up. And so he, uh, he put them away in the fade. And... Now we've just released two of them. Or he did. And we kind of helped. And now we have to stop him. And that's the story so far. It's getting, it's getting interesting, you know? Aha, what is this? Oh, so I see. Good work. Let's keep on the trail. Let's -a go. Oh, what do we get? We better get something good. What is that? Forest Guardian Veil. Uh, that looks kind of sick. How do we? Uh, what was our? How do we like look at our our stuff? Ah, uh, here we go. Yo, that's actually kind of cool. Worn leathers. Why am I wearing... I could wear... Jumper Def leathers, right? Yeah, that's better. But it doesn't change what... Um, what it looks like because... I'm wearing like... This is just a... It's not really a armor. It's just a covering. Like a... Cosmetic, I guess. Do I have any better weapons yet? Rusty. Good... Good, bad. Okay, we're chilling. Better bow. 58, 44. Yeah, we can use that. Very nice. Don't mind me. Oh, so like, is there an option to do hide helmet or uh, you just wear it all the time? Like, if I get into conversations, am Dark I gonna be wearing this don't helmet? Don't usually collect things, do they? They don't, to my knowledge. But Solus's dagger is special. They might be drawn to it. Hmm. Yeah, maybe there's like blight in that dagger or something that is causing them to want it. There's something weird going on with that dagger. 
Or maybe the gods are controlling them. The gods are trying to get the dagger. Anyone spot that ghoul? Whoa. It must have come this way. Maybe they're trying to like get the ghoul to bring the dagger to them. Using ghouls to do their dirty work. Look out. More oh, dogs there's, born ahead. There's one. Ooh. That that was actually pretty pretty good, man. That bow is pretty sick. I'm glad I get to use bow and dagger. That's actually really cool. Some fade touch crystal. More dark spawn coming out of those pools. Oh boy. Uh, staggering takedowns. Perform takedowns with E. Damage enemies to fill their stagger meter. Once full, enemies are staggered, which leaves them vulnerable. Perform takedown E. Okay. Oop, I missed. I think as long as we're up here, I think we're good. I can just bow them. Oh, they're coming up. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Ooh, I did actually, I did like the stagger. Take your shot. Ooh, I could have, I could have done something good. I think I fudged it up a little bit. Yo, the bow is so good. That combat's actually kind of sick. Oh, I got hit. I got hit pretty good. Ooh, hit him in the back. That's the way to go. Oh, fudge. I need to heal. I'm actually getting a little bit butt stuck here. Yo, I gotta be like schmoovin'. I gotta be schmoovin' here. Oh, I could have done E. Can I still do E? Oh, I did it. Nice. I stabbed him in the freaking doodle. That's kind of messed up. I guess I had no other choice. He is a tall boy. He blocked me. Did you find the dagger? I don't think these darkspawn took it. Let's keep no, looking. I didn't have it. Can I go back up here? Because there was like some potions that uh, I could probably use back here this way somewhere. I didn't grab them because I didn't need them at the moment. Where the heck was that? It wasn't too far back, was it? Maybe it was kind of far back. Oh man, maybe I'm maybe I'm freaked here. Maybe I'll find more potions uh, a little farther in, hopefully. I kind of need them now. I was like passing them by because I'm like, I don't need that. You can only have three. It's kind of, that's kind of butts. I wish you had more. Can we pop this? Yeah, we can. Oh, that's how we clear this up. I didn't even realize. Or no, that just led to here. Oh, here we go. Potions. That's what I needed. Very nice. They're kind of generous with the potions, I feel like. Uh, flawless crystal. I wonder, like, when, when we're going to get to actually use... We're picking up a bunch of, like, crafting materials, but when are we going to get to use them? That's what I'm wondering. Over there, our dagger. Oh, is that the one? He's got something. Uh, more blight in the way. He's actually got something there. What does he have? Can I shoot him? Did I actually shoot him? <laughs> Collecting all this heartwood. I uh, I don't like the look of this bridge. Do you guys like the look of this bridge? All right, I guess we'll just go for it. I think maybe we pick this up. Oh, hurry up. I almost just... <laughs> what up, Larry man? I almost just knocked my friends off the bridge. Uh, I'm doing good. How are you doing? How are you enjoying uh, the Veil Guard? Okay, so we gotta f somehow... 
get over there, but there's blight in the way. How do we clear up that blight? Ah, secret chest. Large metal chunk and gold. That's a valuable item. Yeah, when are we going to get to, like, do sales and crafting and stuff? We haven't got... We haven't really done that yet. I see. We pop that. That uh, leads to this. And there's probably another one. Oh. I see. I see where it is. Somehow. We have to get to the other side and then shoot it? Oh, I see. We got to get rid of the bridge. Hurry up, guys. Get off that bridge. Get off that bridge. Quickly. I wonder what would happen if I knocked them into the... Nicely I done. Them down I there. mean, it's gross, but you can't argue with results. So that should clear this up, or make me able to clear it up. Go on and get A uh, clay jar and some gold. Oh, I got a grass blade. A new, a new sword. Where did that little blighted creature go? Let's see, uh, see what that blade's like. Is that one of these? Um, that's 65. This is 76. Nice. We'll do that. Very nice. See that I am good, buddy. Um, getting soon on the 22nd November Black Friday. Oh, right, right. Yeah, I keep forgetting that you said you're getting it on Black Friday. Have you been watching um, people play it and stuff? Well, I mean, you're here watching me play it now, but... Oh, boy. Company, get ready. Oh, I'm on it. I'm already on it. I'm way ahead of you guys. I almost got him. He's, he's done for. These dark spawn are so much different than... Uh, Origins and Dragon Age 2 and yeah, Got us at range. What Watch it. I almost got this fear. Look, another got one him. of those magical beams. There are two of these devices this time. <laughs> Look at him fall. Oh, I what did he drop? We'll I can't get what he dropped. Both of them. Fudge, that sucks. I can't get what he dropped. That's butts. How would they make him drop something that I can't retrieve? I'm not a fan of that. Uh, oh, so we got two beams That's that we one. need to... Now to find the other. ...direct. All right. I see it over there, but how do I get up there? Yeah, I like I don't there's there's the people who are talking crap on it. I haven't seen anything that I don't like yet. Like this game so far has been it's been pretty decent. Oh I'm falling! I'm falling. Wait. I didn't mean to fall, but falling has got me a chest. <laughs> With uh nug carving and gold. Some other stuff. Okay. I just slipped down that crack and I want I stumbled into some stuff. Uh, let's take a potion. Oh, let's grab a potion. This is this all leading me back to get up to that beam cuz I feel like I'm going farther away from that beam. Oh, there's, there's dark problem. spawn. Yep, that's a big problem. Take it to him. He's done. Oh. These little ones aren't so bad. Yeah, all the dark spawn are more ghoulified than what they used to be. They're like more like people that have become dark spawn instead of like how the uh, dark spawn used to just be kind of their own thing. Hey, Cap, what up? 
Is that lizard year? How does the game look so far? Actually, really good so far. I am enjoying. Very much enjoying. Oh, hey there, buddy. Uh, what should I do? Let's do this. Whatever you say. I knocked him away. <laughs> knocked him right off. Armor protects enemies. Oh, I didn't even get to read that. Can we make this jump? How you doing today, Cap? Sauce is Cap. You need to update the dynamic map. It doesn't work. The server is falling into disarray. The bedrock can't join. The dynamic map no longer works. It's, uh, it's all bad. Cap says, I remember it being Dreadwolf. Yeah, it was originally called uh, Dreadwolf. They um, they changed it. Pure ore. Uh, f plus four pure ore. Cap says, uh, he's doing good. Good to hear, good to hear, buddy. There's something behind the waterfall. There's always something behind the waterfall. Yeah, I feel like I'm moving way far away from that thing I was supposed to uh, be doing. Ooh, time-tested trappings. Common, medium, armor. Let's see here. 28 versus 11. Oh, yeah. Let's turn the appearance off. Hide helmet during conversation. Okay, there we go. Never conversations. Appearance on. I like the look of the blood... Uh, Blood Dragon stuff. Yeah, the thing I, I, I keep saying about this game is it's very different from previous Dragon Ages when it comes to the combat. And um, I don't know, a lot of stuff is actually pretty different. Your companions, the way your companions work, the combat. That this, has to uh, be the ghoul we're tracking. Better hope it still has the dagger. The look is kind of similar. It feels like it looks like Inquisition, kind of. That's the, the ghoul with the dagger? I'm going to shoot him. I did nothing. <laughs> Give me that dagger. He's a lyrium ghoul. Can't get along. That's lightning him. Ooh. Yeah, it's way more Got company to the left. Way more action based. Ranged incoming. Oh, we killed him already. That's good. That was easy. Way easier than expected. There it is. Lyrium dagger, that's what it is. Lyrium. Oh Harding? I She shouldn't have picked it up. I... Uh... Whoa. Oh. Oh. Ah! Harding Oh no. This that's... is the eternal hymn. The prayer and the proclamation huh. is our tune I am. We are free again. Whole again. Here again. Here again. What is happening? Harding! I can hear it. The song of the stone. What is happening to me? Yo, this is bad. This is really bad. What the? Um. Are you moving those rocks? I don't know. I don't know how to control it. We're just going to keep her on our team even though she's got some 
Primers and detonators. Combine primers and detonators to trigger detonations. Some abilities may apply a particular primer to a target. Primers uh, use the correct combination to trigger a detonation. Huh. Not Let's, uh... Shred? Let's do that. I'm good to go. That one, that one! Yo, this is so crazy. You don't cross Harding. Yo, Harding's like super powerful now. Harding's gonna have to take on the gods herself. On the left. I didn't mean to do that. That was a waste. On the left. Oh, hey no. Hey now. Ooh, the stagger. They're coming from the right. So good. They're coming from everywhere. If you pay attention, you'll notice they're actually coming from all over the place. Oh, I'm like messing this dude up. Ooh, we get the stagger. This game does a good job of making you feel like super powerful. Didn't even know what hit him. Not at all. Wait, we have more lyrium ghouls? Move. How do we uh how do I block again? I forgot how to block. I'll have to look at the controls or something. Oh, it's that. Okay. Q. You have to do it, like, right at the right time. You know, time the blocks. Nice move, bro. They're aiming for us. We're getting them. We got them. Don't worry about it. I'm actually frigging this guy up a little bit. Don't just stand there. Well, I'm moving. Uh, can you? Can you do this? What does that do? Right, auto. Oh, that adrenaline's us. Oh, I got the. I parried him. That. That dagger. What did it do to me? Not sure, but we should get back. We'll talk it through there. Cap uh, says sold my computer, by the way. Oh, why'd you do that? Are you uh, are you getting the new one? Did you sell Your it for money to get the new one? has failed, sister. And now the magic of the dreadful stagger is hidden from me. Fen Harrell meddles once again. If his stagger is beyond our reach, we must craft another. Made of red lyrium. You said something took you over. Mm, something like that? And it's still with you? Yes. I think so. It can't be possession, can it? I doubt it. Dwarves can't be possessed. They aren't connected to the Fade. Solus's dagger triggered this event. But how? Or why? I'm sorry, Lace. I wish I had answers. It's alright. Talking has helped. And hey, we got the dagger, right? Mission accomplished. Dwarves have never used magic. We can't. Uh -huh. Cap said, uh, no, I realize that. Imagine playing games running on uh, stable 60 FPS rather than actual gameplay. So I'm just doing bonkers in the head gaming. Oh, so you're just, instead of actually gaming, now you're just imagining it all in your head. That's a good way to go. I mean, that saves you money. Don't have to buy the games. 
Um, don't have to buy the computer. Don't have to upgrade the computer. Um, yeah, so I mean, that's that's actually pretty good. Just imagine it. Like, you can imagine that you're playing this. Or you can actually just watch me play it, and then it's like the same thing, right? Um, Rook is wary about Harding's new ability. Optimistic. Baffled. Uh, I'm kind of baffled. I'm going to say it's just weird. I honestly don't know what to think. Tell me about it. Maybe I just need time. It's all strange, but somehow I feel connected. To... To the... To the stone. Dwarves call ourselves children of the stone. Some of us have what we call stone sense. Those that have it can feel caves, lyrium veins, and faults in the rock. I wasn't one of them. Maybe the dagger unlocks something hidden. But, but this is more than the stone sense I know. I know it's strange, but is this going to create problems for us? Um, Saw said, I'll be real, I used to get 30 FPS on Jake's member SMP, now I get over 400. Cap said, ha, you can't save it now, Jake just lost all his subscribers. Thanks for the info that my PC sucks. <laughs> He said you got 60 FPS. I used to get 30. No, he says imagine getting 60 FPS. Imagine if you did. Um, we could uh, we could romance Harding, but I think I'm going to not do that. I am going to I'll keep her as a friend. I trust her. We'll say that much. I trust you have all this handled. You always have things handled. I just hope I can use this magic to do what's right. I have faith. I'll send word to the Grey Wardens about the blight we saw. And then I'm gonna lie down. And we need more answers about what the gods are planning. I'll find some place to relax and try to reach Solus in the Fade. Good luck. Try not to let him get to you. It feels like we're finally making some progress. And I'm not sure what my new magic's about, but I know it feels right. Hmm. With their eyes on the Dreadwolf and the gods he'd set loose, they couldn't see their own personal demons coming to haunt them. Harding told herself it felt right. She was connected to the stone, to the lost <laughs> titans, and all of dwarven history with its buried secrets. How could that be anything but good? Hmm. Cap said he sold his liver and stomach, by the way. <laughs> That's good. I mean, you really didn't need them, right? You weren't using them, so why not? I have now RTX 4090. Decent. That's decent, buddy. The team returned to Solus Ritual Site, hoping to find the Lyrium Dagger that Solus lost. They pried the ancient artifact away from the Darkspawn Ghoul that were drawn to it, but touching the dagger has had a profound effect on Harding, seemingly rekindling a forgotten link between her and the stone. Which means for Harding remains to be seen. What this means for Harding remains to be seen. So would you say she got stoned? Is Harding stoned again? Uh, she's got a common short bow. Nice. Cap says, but I feel kind of dizzy. Guess, uh, nah, you'll be fine. Find some place to try to talk to Solus. You'll be fine, just fine. Level six. Um. Where do we get level up again? Stats. No, we need... We hit level six. How do I do that? Why am I forgetting? Library. Skills. There we go. Uh, we need more rogue core. You will be fine, says Slothman. That's what I say as well. You'll be fine, just fine. Ooh, the repose. Or gain precision after a successful defend. We'll go for that. I like the passives. Uh, I guess we could also actually go for this. So we've unlocked all of this. A hurricane of Blades we could have got. We can like refund all our points and redistribute them, I think, though, too. 
And I think we can start to move on to some of this stuff. Don't need your liver and stomach anyway. Yeah, I mean, what were you using them for? There's no need. You make some money off them things. They'll grow back too, I think, anyway, so. At least mine did when I sold them. I wouldn't worry Wait, much about it. That room wasn't there before, I don't think. We got a new room. I think I'm going to... I keep changing my appearance, but I still don't... I don't quite like the way my appearance is. I'm going to find the place to change it again. Real quick. Before we move on. Where was that? Was that down here? No, it wasn't down here. That's the Alluvian. I wonder if I still can or if I, I've uh, lost the opportunity now. No, it was this, wasn't it? No, that's just a seat. This? Three meetings face-to-face -face under the sky. Maybe I can't do it anymore. Oh. Doors are opening. What is this stuff? What do I just get? Spectre of Battles Pass, Paragon of Leadership, Command Helmet. Oh, it's the, um... I guess this chest got lost in the fade and someone shepherded it to our doorstep. Is it just me or does this armor look somehow familiar? Like something an old friend would wear. Oh, dude, this is Mass Effect stuff. Check this out. Um... Let's see. Uh, we didn't get... No, it's like um, cosmetics. How do I change my cosmetics? Uh, fudge, there's got to be a way, right? Change. I want to see the... Uh, that's minimal effect. No, it's mass effect. Mass. I think maybe here I changed my appearance. Workshop. Yeah? Craft or caretaker's workshop. Upgrading your equipment. Oh, pursue paths. Bring out your equipment's full potential. Collect mementos in the world. Armors. Helms. Okay, so we can upgrade our stuff that we have. But I'm trying to see. We can upgrade these guys' stuff too. Harding got a new bow, I thought. I don't know how I change out their bow. Where the frig? Ayo! Uh, Christ? Uh, dance. Or Christ dance? Welcome to the stream. Much appreciated for the follow. Uh, that's awesome. Very cool of you. Okay, where do I change my appearance, though? That's what's. That's what really matters here. I want to wear the Mass Effect armor. Is it here? Collect. Notes on the caretaker. I know it's here somewhere. Ooh. Imperial Weave. Sold my conscience, by the way. Uh, you, sh you should. I mean, you don't need that either. You don't need any of that stuff. You're, uh, you're all good, buddy. Just sell it all. So they are not going to put any DLC out for this game. It's They're jumping right into Mass Effect. And so that's why they put that Mass Effect armor in here. Which is kind of cool. It's kind of a cool little uh, Easter egg. But I can't figure out how I put my Mass Effect armor on. I know there was a place I went to where I changed my appearance. And I need to find it. Oh wait, there's uh, there's something over here. Study. Oh, this is where you hang out. Couldn't be one god. It had to be three. Can I can I chat with you or no? Don't want to chat. Okay. We can't get over to there yet. It seems. Workshop. Read. Maybe it's over here. Conservatory. 
Yep, they did that last Friday. Yeah, on uh, N7 day. Oh, we're going to talk to Harding. Toldar, it's a tuno. Vedun gar velos atreidum. What is she doing? But velos atreidum is, is nothing like it's a tuno. It's a tuno. I remember. After you touched the dagger, the prayer, the proclamation, it's a tuno. What exactly are you proclaiming? They don't remember. Hmm. No one remembers. We don't even know what we lost. Um. Am I interrupting? You're busy. I shouldn't interrupt. No, no, wait, wait, sorry. Please stay. We can talk. About the stone? About Isatunal? Maybe explaining it to someone else will help get my thoughts in order. So, what is it? What does it mean? Is a tunnel is an affirmation, a statement of existence, of of being. It means I am here. It means but I no, eat the not, tuna. Not I. I is singular, but it isn't. We either. Hmm. We is multiple, but also separate. Uh what? Your language <sighs> is confusing. Is a tunnel is the eternal hymn that encompasses all time. All spaces. I am, we are, this and that, here, there, now, and forever. All, everything at once. That's what it is. It's all at once. Um, uh, I like that you're excited. This is good, you know. What's important this is, a good is sign, that you're I guess. happy. Happy? Happy's not it. Whole. Right, maybe. I'm certain Isatunal describes how we, the dwarves, once were. None of the books say anything about it. None of the histories are right. If we forgot something so important, what else did we forget? I don't know. I'm sorry. I, I, I don't expect you to have an answer. Th thanks for letting me babble, by the no, way. This is wild. Anytime. That's what I'm here for. Yep. Here to listen to babbling. And language I don't understand. Much, uh, much appreciated. Okay, so this is not where I change my appearance. I will never be Commander Shepard here if I, if I can't find this, this situation. So I went up there. Is there a way to go over to here? Yeah, we can go, like, down here. This is the workshop. Okay, maybe this is it. Maybe not. Oh, packing list. Uh, so is this like stuff we need to collect? Erlen has offered to help pack. I'm sure as to why possibly she still feels bad about breakup. Feels bad about breakup. Huh. I don't know what this, I don't know what any of this means. I'll collect that heartwood. Let's go back inside, or do we go up? We could try going up. I'm just enjoying, like, investigating this place right now, to be honest. Aha, it was a good idea to go up. To enter the library passage, three pairings must meet face to face. Okay, so I think these statues have to be shifted. There's one over there, too. I don't know if... Can I get at that one? We have to face them together. Yeah, I think I can actually get at this one. Nice. So now they're facing each other. There must be two more. Okay, this is cool. Little puzzles here and there. It's kind of actually, it's kind of neat. I think, I don't know where the others are. I don't think that I don't know. I actually just don't know. <laughs> Maybe something over here? 
think when we can like locate one, you know, the other one's gonna just be kind of right across from it, right? Look at this place. We planned a rebellion here once. Said we changed the future of the elves, throw off tyrants, and we did. Now the path outside is fractured. I'll be hard rekindling the alluvians. So listen, if you see this, I'll be looking for you out in the world and the mortal one. Don't cause too much trouble before I get there. Oh, here's a statue. Okay. Let's get this. Glazed vase, flawless crystal. So that's not the way. Oh, it's right here. They're literally like right together. There'll be one more after this. Nice. That's the second. One more to go. Yep, 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 yep. Don't know where that would be. There's something up there that I don't know how to reach. Um hmm. yeah, this place is kinda cool. I'm not gonna lie. Been in here. Okay, let's. Uh, we should go talk to Solus. I've been delaying for too long. Either we go talk to Solus or we find the place where I can alter my appearance again. One of those two. I could have swore it was here. Like one of these areas in here. But I must be wrong. All right, Solus, I'm coming. Don't you worry, buddy. I will become Commander Shepard at some point. What about this? This book. This whole place is like super interesting. I want to just investigate the whole lighthouse. Meditation area. Oh, okay. Never Harding must have put my pack here. Makes sense. Better place to sleep than the infirmary. Guess I can spare a few moments to unpack my things. Okay. I can do that. Varric and his life lessons. I asked him how we were supposed to stop Solus, and he gave me this. Take a long, hard look in it, kid. It'll always show the face of a hero who can get it done. Why are we talking like, um... Why are we talking like... Varric's dead. He's not dead, is he? Trying to live up to that. I look good enough for flesh. I'm trying to live up to that. Examine options related to gender identity. Choose one. We'll conclude the conversation. Uh, tattoo options. Examine options related to tattoos. Choose one. We'll conclude this conversation. Tattoo options. Tattoos help me love myself. Tattoos celebrate success. I thought hard about these. Tattoos matter to us elves. The Valaslin are sacred for the elves. I didn't grow up Dalish, but they're not the only ones who have a claim on being elven. My tattoos represent who I am, and I'll wear that for all the world to see. You see, the only thing about those tattoos is they actually were markings to mark you as a slave to one of the elven gods. So, like, I don't remember. Which one is the... I have the tree. I don't know which. I don't remember which one that is. I should have taken the soulless uh, tattoo. Whatever Every time that was. I look at this, I can hear that little girl thanking me for saving her village from Darkspawn. She said that since the Great Wardens didn't have Griffins anymore, I could have hers. If I hadn't been there, I'd never have met Varric, and never had to deal with the first Warden complaining I ignored orders. I think I made the right call. Doesn't matter what the first warden thinks. There's a little girl alive today because I attacked instead of waiting for reinforcements. Yeah. Doing the right thing. A peddler gave me this after I saved his caravan from bandits. He told me the scroll went back to even before Tevinter. Said that elves had a rich history even more than the rest of us. The gods make that hard. He's right. We also face prejudice. He loved traveling. So do I. He's right. We've got a culture that's lasted thousands of years. Good to remember everything we've done. Yeah. You can't forget the past. Well, I collected something this time. Do I sleep on this couch 
Is this my bed couch? Yo, this is crazy. I'm underwater in my room. The tools every professional scoundrel needs when learning the trade. I spent as models? much time picking <laughs> locks and mixing poisons as I did training with blades or a bow. Those were the days. That precision, the good old days. every reagent measured perfectly, the feel of the lock opening, mm, it all just felt right. Right, that's better. Now, how do I connect to Solus? Just sleep or relaxing? Maybe if I clear my mind. Uh... Yeah, like take a nap or meditate, whatever the heck it says to do. Meditate. Let's try it. Look at them fish, man. I'm living underwater. Fish swimming around outside. Back so soon. It must have been worse than I had thought. Hello, Dreadwolf. Ah, but perhaps I am mistaken. You may be here to correct me. To tell me that my concerns were unfounded. You could not possibly be here to take advice from the one you called the Elven God of Lies. Yet here I am. This has been a big week for running into things I didn't think were possible. You are adapting quickly. I need to know what the gods are planning. You are asking for knowledge no mortal in this world is privy to. If I am to share it with you, I need to know what makes you the right person to lead the fight against Algonan and Gelanane. Um, nothing, but I'm here. Someone has to do something. I may not be the right person for this job, but uh, I'm the only one left. So your call to action is that any attempt is better than none? Yeah, Back in actually. the Grey Wardens, I was with a group of recruits outside this village dealing with the Darkspawn incursion. Our orders were to wait for reinforcements, but we knew that by the time they arrived, everyone in that village would be dead. So you led your team of recruits in any way, collapsing the tunnel and saving the village. How'd you know that? You helped Varric pursue me for the better part of a year. It would have been foolish not to learn about who was hunting me. Then you know that if someone has to make a call, I'll do it. I suppose I was not so different when I started. Started what? My rebellion against the Evanuris. The Elven Gods, as you call them. They wish to reclaim their dominion over this world. To accomplish that, they will need two things. First, the Blight. What exists in this world is a bare fragment of its power. The rest is imprisoned. Until they release it. Uh, Christ Dan says, is this your fave game? Uh, it's not bad. I'm enjoying it so far. I wouldn't say my fave. Uh, this is my first time playing it. I'll probably have to try it again. Like, maybe off stream I'll play through it again. Um, but I do, the Dragon Age series is, like, one of my favorite series. So, there is that. So how do we stop them? What would they need to do to free the Blight, and how do we stop them from doing it? They will need to pierce the veil to reach the Blight's prison. My Lyrium Dagger is one of the few artifacts capable of doing so. We've already recovered it from the ritual site. Excellent. Then they will have to make their own. That will give you time. You said the gods needed two things, and the Blight is the first. What's the second? Followers. They have called themselves gods. And what is a god without worshippers to sing their praises? True. I'm not going to bend a knee to blighted murdering monsters just because their ears are pointed like mine. I don't think many other elves are going to either. Agreed. Algonan and Gilanane care little for the elves. They will find worshippers among those hungry for power. Oh. Tyrants and bullies. The cruel and the corrupt. Who just fear like that their mayor. own vulnerability and seize any chance to feel strong. If you hunt them, they will lead you to Algonan and Gilanane. Okay. Yeah, it's just like that mayor who was uh, greedy, and so he, he sold his town out. Thank you. I'll go poke at the cruel and the corrupt, and we'll see what we find. The Veravas, the lighthouse Saluvian, can take you anywhere, if you master its secrets. Have you done so? Not yet, but we've got one of the veil jumpers working on it. She'll get it sorted, and we'll see how it goes. Yes. Well, he should be able to tell I me how it works. We will. 
And when you speak with Varric, please tell him that I regret what happened. Hmm. So, so such a, a switch here, you know, like the whole time, I mean, they called it Dreadwolf originally. The whole time you're thinking that Solus is the bad guy. Oh, you have acquired new appearance for your equipment. Appearance can be modified at the wardrobe. Nice. Okay, so that's how we do it. All that time I was running around looking, I couldn't figure it out. But, I mean, all this time we've been thinking that it's Solus. You know, he's the bad guy because it was called Dragon Age Dreadwolf originally. But then, but then they changed it. And now it's uh, the Veil Guard. And Solus, like, he's locked up. We don't, we don't even, we go talk to him, but that's it. It's, it's, it's very strange. Spectre of Battles Pass. Paragon of Leadership. We got the Blood Dragon Vestments. Do we want Par Beyond the Stars? Armor may cause clipping in scenes designed for casual wear. Oh, I'm. It's. This is my casual wear choice. Oh, okay. I need to. I want to put this on instead of the Blood Dragon stuff. Why is it doing this? Paragon of Leadership. Oh, so this is casual wear. Okay, so this is stuff I'm going to wear when I'm at... When I'm here. Okay. So we got Spectre of Battles Pass, Beyond the Stars. And this one. Which one do we like more? I think I kind of like this one as like a casual wear. I think this one's a little better. Because it's kind of like... I don't know, it seems more comfy save uh, so we can change this oh actually oh we can put this on for this too actually okay nice so let's do that one then that's gonna be our uh, our appearance we have other helmets oh yeah the commander helmet Mask of the Blood Dragon. Oh, okay, so these are these are cool. I didn't even realize I had all these options. Let's do the command helmet. Yo, that's pretty sick. Look at that. Very nice. We can change their uh, stuff too. Bolara's Nerve. There we go. Okay. They can't wear helmets though, can they? Harding's focus. Nice. And Nev can have Nev's fervor. She wears like a hat, but they can't have, uh... can we give you different stuff? Cat's eye or snake's eye? Uh, we'll, leave, we'll leave that how it is. I think we're pretty good now we got the um we got the commander stuff which is pretty cool like when we're back at base we can have this and then when we uh head out we'll have uh oh i can put another thing down oh decoration mode oh okay cool we can move our stuff around i see it's kind of neat Gotta talk to Varric. Where is where are we keeping Varric these days? I haven't seen him in a while. They were acting like he was dead, you know, but he's he's around. Mr. Varric, how you feeling, buddy? So Solus told the truth about the gods. You heard? It's bad, Varric. If you had seen them at his crossing. The team needs to so act bad. fast. And it can't do that with me leading from a bed. You've got to take point on this. If that's what you want. I'll get it done. I never doubted it. Never might. Rook, when I put this team together, what did I look for? A detective to find the Dreadwolf, and a scout to get us the lay of the land. Exactly the people he'd expect me to recruit. Disciplined. Predictable. And then there's you. 
Remember when we first met, kid? I watched you lead a few misfit recruits and push back one of the biggest darkspawn hordes I've ever seen. Just needed to find the right strategy. And no other warden found it. You stopped that horde. Had to drop a town hall on it, but you've got a knack, kid. For what? Finding a way through the wildest shit I've ever seen. <laughs> with a plan that no one expects. Nice. On the best day of his life, Solus wouldn't see you coming, Rook. And don't worry. I'll still be here to talk if you need me. Uh, we can ask him more? Um... I think we're good. I think we can. Uh, I'll talk to you later. I can always come I'll back and I think some ask some questions. You're gonna be fine, Rook. Uh, hey, one last thing before you go. I've been racking my brain thinking of contacts who might help us with these gods. You got any ideas? Nothing. But being a leader isn't about having all the answers yourself. It's about knowing who does. Nev has connections to a whole world that Harding and I barely know. Might be worth talking to her. Will do. Thanks, Varric. Anytime. Alrighty. Alrighty then. Are we gonna figure out how this... Yeah, I wish you could be out here too. I, I, I'm gonna miss having Varric as a companion, you know? Two games we got Varric to be our companion. And now the third, he's... You know, he's just, uh, he's doing his own thing. It's sad. We heading to, where are we heading to? Where's this one? Workshop. Yeah, yeah, okay, we already looked at that. Oh, check in with Niv, okay. Nev, you've got wisps? Yeah, hmm. they came with the place. But you're here for leads. That's interesting. You want allies to go after the gods. I've got places to look, if we can get anywhere but all of them. Ballara's working on it. What have you got? Oh yeah, where are they keeping Ballara Let's start here? with the angles we know. The gods are corrupt magic personified. Who do we hire to fight that? First, the Antivan crows. You want to fight gods with assassins? Not a bad Not idea. just any assassin. Their most feared mage killer, the demon of Virantium. Hmm. More? Mage killer isn't a problem. Um, I'm intrigued. I am. Well, I'm very I'm sold. intrigued. Now we charm the crows. Fingers crossed. The demon got his nickname taking out blood mages and venatori. From everything I've learned, the reputation was earned. I never uncovered his real name, and there's been fewer stories the last few years, but the crows would know. I can set a meeting with their bosses. Do you notice she's got stitch stitches in her, uh, she had a bruise on her head, <laughs> and she's got stitches in a bruise. You don't, you don't stitch up a bruise. Why did that happen? Let's give it a try. Time to make new friends. We'll see if it works. You said the crows were first. What's next? A trip home. Back to Minrathis. Capital city and heart of Tevinter. An empire of mages that knows a thing or two about corrupt magic. Tevinter authority won't help and can't be trusted. Which is why we talk to the Shadow Dragons. They're mm. a resistance group that fights slavers, blood magic, and imperial corruption. They've got eyes and ears everywhere, including mine. If the gods enter the Empire, we might get something. Besides, I owe them an update. Your friends are our friends. These people sound great. I mean, if they're anything like you. No one's as good as they seem. But they try. So, we talked to the crows in Antiva and the shadow dragons in Minrathis. I wouldn't mind checking in on my neighborhood either. If Balara's ready for us. Yeah, should check how things are going. All right, so we have a plan. We're, we're gonna gather some friends. We're gonna either get the crows or the shadow dragons. I wonder if it's a choice between the two or if you're doomed to fail at one and then uh, you gotta get the other. Christian says, did you try hell divers? I have not, no. All these 
a lot of people talking about it, um, but I never got into it. I don't know. I, I play more story-based games, kind of like this, more survival stuff like Minecraft, you know, the um, crafting and survival stuff, and I play, like, story games, RPGs. Those are more, more my speed. Apart from stream, what do you do for work? Uh, so I work in a factory. Almost there. I just have to... Shit! Sorry. Can I help? No, no, I got it. Mostly. Mirrors are funny things, aren't they? Reflections. They distort reality, no matter what you try. Ah. And there's the trick. Control that distortion and... Ooh. There you have it. <gasps> what is that place? If I had to guess, it's the Fade. Another part of it, I mean. Didn't Morrigan say this Alluvian could go anywhere? Didn't think that meant elsewhere in the Fade. She hmm. called it the Veer of Us. Freedom of ways. I wonder... Uh, Christian said, kind of curious about something. Why haven't you set up customized animated emotes for your channel? Well, see, I'm not, I'm not really good at technology. Like, I don't know how to do that stuff. <clears throat> I would if I could, but... And I also, like, I work full-time... I do this a lot of days and uh, I have another channel that I also try and work like I got a lot of stuff going on so I never really have the time for that what's the background behind me so I have um Dragon Age Inquisition poster this is like some kind of map I don't even know it's just been there forever uh, and I got a bunch of beer cans there's a beer can collection that like wraps all around this room it's a big room it's a, an entire basement I also got um Sword? Swords? Are oh, you visiting my merch store? You have uh, nice collections? Nice. I appreciate that. Appreciate you checking that out. Recently done a merch project for my client. Let me show you some of my work for my portfolio. Also, I'm working for multiple streamers if you would like to see some of my work. Um, maybe Morgan was wrong. Maybe Morgan got this one wrong or misspoke. Morgan can be a little inscrutable sometimes, but she chooses her words very carefully. Some of the older texts talk about a place in Soft the fade where LOL. all the got him, boys. meet. <laughs> a crossroads where you could travel That's across right. all of Thetis in just minutes. Right. We saw something similar when we were chasing Solus. I wonder if it's the same. It is alike, and it is not. Oh, it's the spirit. Who are you? Who are you? And how did you get here? The wolf's fang. You carry it now. Old paths. A new journey. Through there. I will wait. Hmm. Well, can't tell if that's a trap or not. But we're short on options. One way to find out. And it's it didn't feel dangerous, you know? Almost more sad. Let's be careful here. We have no idea what or who they are. So let's be careful. We need to be ready for anything. And we still don't know what this Alluvian's gonna do. One of us should probably stay behind in case it closes. Good point. Just tell us when you're ready to go, Rook. And then we can figure out what's going on. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna try this. Awakening. Discover a single blade and the awakening of ancient magic. So do we uh, We walk into it? So we're going to take... Yeah, we'll leave Bellara behind because she's um, she's got to work on this thing. Team explores a crossroads, a mysterious network of mirrors that allows instantaneous travel in order to recruit more people to their cause. Okay, cool. Start quest. We're not going to get like too far into it. I think I've only got like 19 minutes left. But we'll start it. We'll see what happens. Hello again.
again. Who are you? A caretaker. I go where I am needed, Dweller. Now, I am here. And where is here? The crossroads. Hmm. Hey, Destruction Sloth, you just followed. Oh, nice. Much appreciated. I can't believe you weren't following before. What the heck, Mr. Sloth? Uh, I could use a guide. Can you help us? I get the feeling this is no place to get lost. The Evanurus hunger for the crossroads. Their influence is spreading. Blight. Death. Madness. They send their minions to claim this place. The crossroads is in a time of need, Dweller. I cannot protect you. You don't have to. If you're standing against the gods, then consider us reinforcements. Sauce and I swear I unfollowed, then followed for the sound. I, I didn't pay attention. Did we get... Or is the uh, notification on the stream actually working? Like, it should pop up. And say that you followed I, all this stuff like it never wants to work i set up notifications for subscribers and members and follows and and uh subscribers on twitch and like the stuff doesn't actually work on the stream i heard it i think it works yeah if it made the sound i would think that it it did but so we got the crossroads to explore now blight roots and Magical seals? What's through there? Reven Revenant as, uh, essence? Hmm. I sound muffled now, like, uh, like Shepard. <laughs> I actually kind of sounded like Shepard. I was like, why do I sound different? I actually kind of sounded like Shepard there. That was interesting. Didn't even get the sound this time. Yeah, it probably only works once. Well, YouTube is set up on, um, actually, no, they're both set up on Streamlabs, but Twitch wasn't working on Streamlabs, so I set up Twitch through Twitch to do notifications, and I think it Here, still is, this like, dock seems sturdy. broken. Whoa, will we get a boat? So you can ferry us to the other islands. Winds await, Dweller. Yeah, this is cool. I'll take that as a yes. Places between. This is so crazy. I wasn't expecting all this. The spirits here were driven out. Refugees now from the gods' minions. I have summoned the guardians of the crossroads to protect them. Beware. The Guardians rebel all interlopers. So we're interlopers too? Oh, we can gather your party? So you can change your party if you want. We want Harding and Nev, I think. I think that's good. Yes. Alara can stay home. She's got to do her science work. What, uh... Okay, so now we're going this way. It was telling me to go back, but now it's telling me to go this way. Treviso or Docktown? Came in the stream from normal into I am a graphic artist. Want to see my artwork I found on Google and claim it's mine. You know, the, uh, a lot of the graphic artists, I don't know, maybe they're not all scammers, but a lot of them are scammers. The fate here. That's where they're breaking through. The gods are breaching the fate itself. Oh. And just for us. Hey, we got to fight. Got company. Our gods feed us. We got a fight on our hands. 
Did that do anything? I don't think I hit anybody. Ooh, that got good. Yeah, I love that. Uh, I love being able to dodge them like this. Nice move. Ooh, let's hit him with this. There we go. Ninety-five percent of them are assist slot. Yeah, I mean, majority. Yeah. But uh, some of them might be real. I don't know. It's it's hard to say for sure. But usually they start out like with a normal intro and then they jump into. Oh, by the way, I'm a graphic artist. Ooh, between a rock and a hard. Good work, everyone. Five takedowns. Examine the blighted roots. I'm sure there's a way to break through them or something. The gods' blight and blood magic has sealed the way. Only their champion may open it. A champion? It dwells on this island. Challenge the champion and claim its essence. This path will open to you. Sloth says massive respect for the people that made the art. Yeah, for sure. I'm sure not everybody is uh, a scam, like I said. I'm sure some of them are actually making their own art. But um, and it would be helpful. I mean, I kind of, I could use some, like, emojis uh, or emotes, animated emotes. And um, I could use stuff like that. You know, that would be helpful. But I need somebody who's not just a scamage to do it. Ooh, we get chests and stuff. It's locked, huh? Oh, no. The Warden Spear. Uncommon armor. Harding. Okay. Sauces, really? Well, yeah, like, I don't... I have my uh, emojis that I've made, but I don't have like emotes of them that actually move. I don't know how to animate that stuff. Uh, uh, is there something inside it? Well, I'm actually a graphic artist. I looked up some images on Google. I will lie and say they're mine. Want to see my artwork? Laird Man says you're doing a good job, buddy. Much appreciated, Laird Man. I'm, I'm doing I'm doing what I can do here. Light sis, let's kill this thing. This is gross. That's the champion oh. we're looking for. Watch That's yourselves. a puppy. That's just a puppy. Move quick. That did it. This thing is tough. Get clear. Holy frig. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. Siren the Twice Forged. God dang it, he's wild. I don't think I could block him. Need to move. Ooh. I actually kind of like this fighting now that I'm getting like more used to it. It's actually kind of cool. Take the shot. Ooh, that did some damage. Got him. We got him. It's like an ogre. Uh, would you, would you like some of my artwork, Sisloth? This guy is in Dragon Age Three. Champion essence. That's the essence we need. It's cold. Ugh. Hope I don't have to carry it for too long. I love the uh, the new look, man. This is pretty sick. Oh, potions full. Yeah, he looked like an ogre. Didn't he? The guardians can't hold them off for long. We're going. We're schmoving. Lair Man says, yep. Alright, 
right, let's go. As the gods' champion passed freely, so will you. Nice. So I'm like the new gods' champion? Is that what you're telling me? That's a lot of oh. Alluvians. And they're all intact. I wonder where they lead. Hmm. Time to find out. We just gonna step into them and see where they go? Open the journal to contact the Shadow Dragons or recruit an assassin. What do I go with? Final Legion Vessel, Currency, and an Elven Lantern. Oh, we get some decor. We can decorate our room. Press J to open the journal and track quests. Okay. Um, travel to Docktown. Contact the Shadow... The Shadow Dragons or the Assassins? What do I want to go with? This is a this is a choice I have to make here now. I think since we're just about at the end today, like I'm almost at two hours, I think I'm just going to go ahead and call it for today. And we will think about it for the next time. And uh, we'll make our choice in the next episode. But uh, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like there on YouTube, subscribe to the channel, turn on the notifications so you don't miss out on future streams or videos. You can also follow on Twitch if you like watching over there. If you want to help support the channel, only 99 cents to become a member on YouTube, get you a bunch of cool perks. So definitely check that out. Another great way to support would be checking out merch. We got these cool hats, shirts, all kind of stuff like that. But anyways, guys, I think that just about does it. So thanks again for watching, and hopefully I will see you in the next one. Peace.